Wow, that's a big difference. Yes, I splurged. I'm renting a rug doctor for one day so I can clean the rugs around in here because I want to get the inside of the house nice and clean so when it's cold and you close yourself up in the house that it's cleaner. I've been wanting to do that for a long, long time. Also, I got a book called The Complete Idiot's Guide to PC Basics. It has spreadsheets in there and how to do Word... What do they call that? Where you type Word Perfect, Word something. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, things like that. I'm trying to be self-improving. Everyone seems to have started on this self-improving kick for October. Well, I'm going to try as well. I've gained half the weight that I lost back, and I need to lose it again and keep going because my nicer clothes don't fit right now. And if I, or when I get an office job, I have to be able to know how to do those computery things, and I have to look nice. So, those are a couple of my goals. Yes, the government shut down, and I felt pretty bummed out this morning, and hopeless, and helpless, and alone. I don't like feeling alone. I can be alone, but I don't like feeling lonely. I was feeling that way, and feeling crummy, and congested, and I was lying in bed as long as I could, putting off everything as long as I could. I finally got up, and because I, I hadn't eaten, I got the shakes. I was shaking, 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 and these two fingers on both hands were numb, and my upper left thigh is numb. I don't like that either. It's my back. I'm pretty sure it stems from my lower back. And I can't really have a job where I'm on my feet because I won't be able to walk. It hurts my back so bad that everything inside my body hurts. Everything. The kidneys, the bladder, every all my internal organs hurt real bad if I'm on my feet for a long time. And that's not cool. And it does help if I lose weight, but it's still there. I've, I, when I had lost those 20 pounds and I'm on my feet, it's still there. Unfortunately. So, self-improvement time, I suppose. God knows how long this government thing will last. The president was on TV again about it this, today, basically blaming one fraction of people. And had a whole bunch of uh, citizens standing around him talking about this lady and has MS and she'll be able to have health care now and this lady could not afford it before and she can have it now, you know, that kind of thing. Trying to convince the public that it's okay, we're doing the right thing. I don't know, it's uh, crazy. The healthcare.gov website, I checked it yesterday before it was in, before it was active. And got some basic information. Today it was supposed to have more specific information, but today there were so many people checking out the website that it crashed. Well, I'll wait a little while. I have until... If I want to be... I have six months. And if I want to be insured by January 1st, I have another two months to uh, sign up. So... Oh, so much to do. Yeah. It's nice out today, but very, very humid. It's supposed to be very humid and hot for the next three days and then very cold on Sunday. Who knows? I want to get my ducks in a row and everything in order and try to get Scott's car working and sell it. Those are goals that I have in the next couple weeks. My car is due to for ins inspection next month, but I can do it a month ahead of time. So I really need to get my butt in gear and get things in order. I've been thinking of building a little s soundproof um, recording booth. I have lots of equipment, my father's equipment. I just have to figure out exactly how it works. He had a lot of, he was a ham radio operator and electronic engineer, so he's got a lot of nice, cool stuff. Older stuff, but still it works. So, I don't know. Been very creative feeling. I want to do my music and some more painting. So I know when I'm depressed I get more creative, so it's good in a way, 
and bad in a way. Okay, I see the clock behind you is faltering. It needs a new battery. Oh boy. <laughs> Every time I'm somewhere, you can hear click, click, click. Yeah, the life of a person obsessed, I suppose. Who knows? All right. <laughs> Tomorrow's Whoop Whoop Wednesday, and I have to find a good juicy joke for you. I haven't found it yet, but I'm going to. See you then. Upward and onward.